Hey guys, my name is Daniel. Welcome back to the Crosslink channel. We talk about the 32-bit mainboards on the new Creality printers. And you might have seen this in the news or you might have read some Twitter about the new 32-bit mainboards. Creality just announced officially that all future Ender models are gonna have the 32-bit mainboard. And I also saw some people tweeting about that their Ender 3 Pro or Ender 3 already got the new mainboard. Then Chap from the Chap channel, he ordered specifically a new printer from Creality directly and he still got the 8-bit mainboard. So what I see happening right now is that Creality is clearing off their old printers and they selling off everything that they have and then they slowly start using the new 32-bit mainboard. So if you order a new printer at the moment, you not know what's going to come, if it's gonna have an 8-bit or a 32-bit mainboard. So if I was in your position trying to order a new printer right now, I either would try to figure out by contacting Creality directly or the seller if it has a 32-bit mainboard or just wait a little bit longer to be sure that you get the latest stuff. I've already ordered a new mainboard separately. It came available in the online store, in the Creality 3D official online store this week. So you can already order that separately and I ordered one to test it out. I mean, this is also a shift that I see in a lot of other printer manufacturers that they go for 32-bit. And also on this channel, you're gonna see this change happen because I'm going all in on 32-bit. So this old mainboard is gonna go into the waste bin this is an ANET mainboard, something for the waste bin. I think it's time to make the change. And it's also time to see and accept that making uh, content and videos for 8-bit mainboards, probably the time is over for that. There is probably a lot of still existing printers out there who have an 8-bit mainboard, who are, are people who want to upgrade those printers with new firmware. If you've seen my last videos, it's getting harder and harder. So you have to do a lot of tricks to uh, incorporate new features into those 8-bit printers if you want to go for Marlin 2.0. I think it's just not worth investing so much time into upgrading those old printers. Instead, swap out the mainboard and that's what I'm also going to do on all of my printers. They are going to get either the new uh, Creality mainboards or SKR mainboards. And that's why you're gonna see more SKR and Creality 32-bit mainboards reviews on this channel. I wanted to make this quite earlier, but uh, never came to do it. And now it's time for it. So let's go for 32-bit for sure this time. Bye-bye.